Hey, this is Tony Ross for TonyTeach.com, and this quick tutorial is for our friends over at Tube Tape. Uh, what we're going to be doing is doing a simple matte painting. We're going to add a moon to this scene here. So uh, this is what we're going to be doing. So here's our before video, and here's the after. So we're going to be adding a moon into here. And you might be thinking, dude, that moon is huge. Well, you know, you can make it smaller if you like, but uh, I, I, I like a big moon. Big moons are awesome. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. We're going to be using a really awesome compositing program, and it's called Photoshop. Yes, that's right. We're going to be using Photoshop, only Photoshop. All right, so we've got here, you can open up your video inside of Photoshop. I'm using Photoshop CS4. Uh, so I've got my video open, and I also have a JPEG of the moon. It's got black background around it, and none of that matters uh, because we're going to be fixing that. So uh, you can always look online for free images. Uh, I think even NASA actually has images out there that you can use. So it's pretty awesome. So I'm going to do uh, Command A, Control A on PC. Let's do Copy, and let's see. Let's go back over here, and we are going to paste this Command V, Control V on PC, and what I think I want to do initially, uh, I think I want to scale this a little bit. So let's do Command T, Control T on PC. I'm holding down my Shift key to make sure it stays in proportion. And I think about there's pretty good. Let go of the mouse, let go of the keyboard. All right, and hit our Enter key or return. Now on this layer, I'm simply going to come over here and double click, and it's going to open up. Um, our little layer style area. Now, this is the section we're going to mess with. I'm going to leave it on blend if gray. I'm going to move this up a little bit. And if you notice, hey, that black went away almost instantly. And I'm going to move it a little bit closer. I'm going to zoom in here so I can see this a little better. So if you notice the little black edge around there, I'm going to hold down my Option key, Alt on PC, to soften up the edges a little bit. Now you don't want to go too far because it starts cutting into it. So it's just going to be a little bit. Not too worried about that edge because I'm going to probably shrink it down a little bit more. So click on OK. All right, now the thing is that's black square is still there because if I'm going to hold on my command key or control on PC and click there, that square is still there. So what we're going to do, let's deselect this, command D. Uh, I'm going to add another layer. Okay, and we're going to merge this layer down. Quick key is going to be Command E, Control E on PC. Now, if we check this, awesome. All right, so we've got our moon set up there. Let's deselect this. All right, and I want to move this up a little bit, and I'm going to shrink this down a little bit. So we'll do Command T again, Control T on PC. I'm holding down my shift key, let go of the mouse, let go of the keyboard. Hit return or enter. All right, now, so that's set, and boom, we're done. Okay, that, that looks pretty bad. Well, let's make it look like it really belongs in the scene. We're gonna go back again to layer styles just by double clicking there. And what we're gonna do is a color overlay. So click this box here. And what I wanna do? Let's make sure you have that selected. Let's click there. And I'm going to sample the color of the sky. There's several colors here, but I'm going to let's go about the middle way. Okay. So looks pretty decent. And we're going to go ahead and click on OK. And we'll set this mode to screen. And wow, it fits perfectly in the scene. And we're set. So this is a. Uh, the video with our little new map painting in it. And that's how we got to this point. So I hope this has been helpful. This has been Tony Ross for TonyTeach.com. And remember, keep it simple. Make it perfect. If you don't have time to make it perfect, rethink the idea.